Good evening, I'm Rena Ninen. Breaking news tonight, CBS News entrance polls in Nevada show Bernie Sanders is likely headed for a win in today's caucuses. But once again, the state party is slow to report official results. Nicole Killian is in Las Vegas tonight. Nicole, good evening. Good evening to you, Rena. And Bernie Sanders seems to be bolstered by a number of factors. According to our entrance polls, he did well among young voters, first time caucus goers, and those who picked health care as their top issue. So let's go out there. Let's <laughs> The Democratic candidates for president made their final pitches. Thanks for participating in democracy. All the way up to caucus time. Who are you caucusing for today? Elizabeth Warren. Bernie Sanders. Nevada Democrats worked feverishly to avoid Iowa's fate, scrapping its problematic app for lower tech options, a caucus calculator and worksheet. Everything is just right before them and it's very transparent. Last name A through F. But there was another issue, scattered reports of a lack of volunteers. We are short about three volunteers here at this site, but we have a very talented group of uh, veterans, seasoned uh, campaign workers. The first in the West Caucus culminates days of early voting where turnout neared 75,000. With voters of color making up more than a third of the electorate, state party officials like John Summers insist Nevada matters. Nevada is incredibly important so we can get a candidate that's appeal, that, that we know can appeal to everyone across the country. Many of the candidates aren't even in Nevada to watch the results tonight. They've already left and moved on to Super Tuesday State. Serena. Nicole Killian in Las Vegas. Thank you.